the best of Chaz and Dave. I was once walking through Walthamstow Market with a female friend when Ain't No Pleasing You came blasting out of one of the shops. I took my companion in close hold and we waltzed amongst the stalls. It was only then that I realised how much I loved that song. Chaz and Dave were not an act people like me would have liked at the time. They became successful with two songs they wrote and performed for TV adverts. So Gertrude and Rabbit, however witty and well performed, were as credible as I'd like to buy the world a Coke or you can't fit quicker than a quick fit fitter. They celebrated the London language of our fathers. My granddad was from Essex. He wore collarless shirts and braces and used phrases like Gertrude and Cowson. Chaz and Dave never had the credibility of Ian Dury, but they did have lines like, you can keep your Costa Brava and all of that palaver. And their ultimate line, which had to be, if you don't think I mean what I'm saying, I'm only bluffing. Well, you got another thing coming, I'm telling you that for nothing. It is funny because people did say things like that. Chaz and Dave grew with credibility when it became known that they were experienced session musicians. A track they played on was famously sampled by Eminem. The image they chose, however, was not that of the experienced professional studio musician, but it was a look they would have grown up with. They were not EastEnders, but they were from areas close to the North Circular. I saw Chaz and Dave with their regular drummer Mickey Burt at Wickham Town Hall. And when they played Ain't No Pleasing You, people danced in the aisles. It is said Chaz and Dave were one of the great rock and roll trios. Mostly they sang to 12 bar piano boogie with their distinctive two part harmony. Songs about needing braces to keep up their trousers because they're getting a beer belly and having to keep the noise down because the old man's trying to get some kip. Kitchen sink mini dramas from a black and white olden days. In an East End with Cockneys and Costa mongers doing the Lambeth Walk. Oi. They sing about London girls who always had a pound to buy a round. And they end with a big string laden love song about wishing they could write a love song. As time went on, Chaz and Dave started to sound more like status quo and vice versa. Ending their careers with a big party. Still mustn't grumble. Best of Chaz and Dave.